as we get ready for our top star junior stands. Leading us away is Harrison Berris and TJ Hoist to get us green in heat race number one. Of our junior sedan drivers as host on the outside on the XJ pack. Hyundai excels. We've got one car already flapping the wind. That looks like Jamali Nun, Muhammad Domas, Harrison Barris. Oh, one's gone upside down big. That was the 81 of Oscar Amado. It was clobbered as well by the 63. Getting ready for the restart of heat rates number one for our top star junior sedan. Horn and Harrison Barris who... Probably got the luckiest of them all. There goes the flap again from Jamali Nun Muhammad Dom. Somehow one bumper has come off. I'm not too sure who that is, but out of all of that, we've still got the back bumper flagging, flapping in the wind of Jamali Nun Muhammad Dom, and the yellows have come out. Take the two one one to the infield. Yeah, I'll pull him in. Uh, two one one. Jamali Nun Muhammad Dom. He's been having everything come around in the air. Along with a bumper. It's actually the bumper off Muhammad Dom's car. Mitch Colleen for the win from Jamie Higgs. Late night pit interviews. Thanks, Morg. See you tomorrow for a beer or two. That's from Brendan Higgs. Good luck, Jesse, in your first Top Star meeting. Love, Tish and Miller. Can't forget as well, Jesse Hammond has also moved up into Top Stars. His fingers crossed he doesn't see the same sort of a deal that Oscar Amato happened. Or saw, I should say. So we'll give him another attempt at a start for our Top Star Junior Sedans. I'm going to have to say it. We'll try and find some classic results while we can because obviously we've got the Grand Annual Sprint Car Classic. Night number one happening. So too as well. Night two of the King's Royal out of Kingaroy. So there's three for you, Jeff, on your bingo card. Harrison Barris, TJ Host. It looks like we're into heat races. We've completed nine heat races so far. Jackson Dillamont just won heat race number nine. Time trials group one went to Jock Goodyear from Brock Hallett and Lockie McHugh. Tyler Courtney driving the West Australian 17. Come home in fourth at the moment. We'll try and see who else is in that one. We'll find some more results. Oh, sorry, we'll go into number two. Brock Zierfoss, the quickest in group two for Gold Star Transport Racing. Brad Sweet driving for Landrigan Racing was 10th. Kerry Madsen in the Cricky Motorsports car number 2 was 7th. Other names in there that we can see with West Australians is none. So that's what we've got so far. Heat race number 1 with Jock Goodyear from Tyler Courtney and Lachlan McDonald. Heat, th heat 2 was Jack Lee, Brock Hallett and Darren Molino. Good to see Molly back in the car. Lockie McHugh, Geordie Ray and Brent Milbourne in heat race number three. As we go back to racing in our top star junior sedans, Harrison Berris. Well, there may be some mechanical dramas for the 18 as the boys earth moving. Hyundai excels all. We've got cars scattered from pillar to post. Jake Lehman. Just jumping up and down onto the infield. Lucky he did not go upside down as he, Jake Fisher, and Jesse Hammond, a trio of Bunbury boys at the back of the field. As it's a TJ Host in car number 29 running away with it at the moment from Vince Lindsay, who's really come of age. Oh, there was harsh contact between Muhammad Dom and Kanan Harrison as going up on two wheels was the 2 1 1 machine. Lucky not to go upside down as they roll up the hill, though. It's all TJ Host in the X Giant Pack machine from Vince Lindsay. What we're trying to say about Vince Lindsay is really come of age as of late in the 40 machine. As Jesse Hammond, in his first ever Top Star Junior Sedan race, has just set the fastest lap of the race and he's on a charge. He's up to eighth place getting past. Kanan Harrison, who looks like he's starting to slide at all. As we say that, he goes around in turn number four. We're giving him 
Well, the biggest of applause in the Haytech car number five, but sadly has gone around and we're back to the tail of the field. Mind you, the drivers fighting out for the race leader, really going at it from pillar to post. It's host from Lindsley back to Harrison Berris, who somehow found himself up. Back to third place after a horrible start. So somehow the 80 machine is on the move. So too is Colby Bosley in the 78 machine. He's in fourth place and it's Muhammad Dom. Jake Lehman coming through the field as well. They're almost going upside down. He's back up behind Muhammad Dom, who's running in fifth place. Then it's Melentus Ferraro, Jake Fisher, and Jesse Hammond at the tail of the field. As it's now Jake Lehman with the quickest lap of the race in car number 70. As him and Muhammad Dom are starting to close the gap on Colby Bosley. As Muhammad Dom just chasing the top side of the racetrack. The 2-1-1 machine. As he runs the outside, Jake Lehman also trying to find a way through. An absolute classic. So they're three wide for the minor placings and right to the inside taking two of them is Jake Lehman getting both Bosley and Muhammad Dom to go into fourth place. The white flag is out though for TJ Host who's just been all calmly out in front in this one. Ahead of Lindsay and Harrison Berris. But what a recovery it has been from Jake Lehman to get up to fourth place. So check and flag will come out and it's going to be a good win for car number 29. TJ Host takes the first for the top star junior sedans. He wins it from Vince Lindsay with his brand new KJB fabrication gear. He finishes a runner up from Harrison Berris and Jake Lehman. Lehman though, what a return. After almost spinning out on that opening lap. Your win though. And a great effort from TJ Host taking home your opener for the top star junior stands. Our next will be our new stars.